Israel and Hezbollah start a large-scale war, Lebanon turns into a second Gaza. The world is on the brink of a catastrophe. UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres said, pointing to the risks of a potential devastating conflict between Israel and Hezbollah. The head of the Shia militia, Hassan Nasrallah, warned that Hezbollah is prepared for a full-scale conflict with West Jerusalem and could invade the Jewish state's northern territories in case of further escalation. The statement came after one of the group's senior commanders, Hajj Sami Taleb Abdullah, was killed in an Israel strike on southern Lebanon last week. One rash move, one miscalculation, could trigger a catastrophe that goes far beyond the border and, frankly, beyond imagination. The UN Secretary General told reporters at a press conference, adding that the world cannot afford Lebanon to become another Gaza. He also called on both sides to urgently recommit to peace. The world must say loudly and clearly, immediate de-escalation is not only possible, it is essential. Guterres said, there is no military solution, he said, adding that many people had already lost their lives or had been driven from their homes, both in Lebanon and Israel. The UN peacekeepers on the ground are already working to de-escalate tensions and help prevent miscalculation in an extremely challenging environment, Guterres added, without providing any specific details. The Jewish state's foreign minister, Israel Katz, warned that West Jerusalem was very close to a decision that would change the rules of the game against the Shia militia. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has warned Israel would turn Beirut into Gaza in the event of a war. But a wider escalation could also overwhelm Israel's famed Iron Dome missile defense system that has so far intercepted most of the hundreds of missiles fired by Hezbollah. My sense is that Hezbollah feels it has some leverage over Israelis because an escalating war, as much damage as it might do in Lebanon and Syria, would create terror in Israel said Seth G. Jones, an analyst at the Center for Strategic and International Studies in Washington. It would be a tall order for Israeli air defenses to confront the widespread rocket arsenal coming from the north. It would be a huge problem. Israel launched a major military operation in Gaza last October in response to a deadly attack by Hamas.